Heidi ho neighbors, Rado Goji here, and welcome back to Squeeze the World, uh, Lego Marvel Avengers extra DLC videos. And when we last left off, uh, we started the all-new, all-different Doctor Strange DLC, uh, and I'm basically trying to find out what to do for the most part, but I'm also, you know, keeping my eye out for things like this. There, that's batteries for remote control, okay? Like, you know, something that, that would be able to, you know, keep things in mind for getting, uh... For getting uh, mini kits and such, like that's what this dig spot's probably going to be—is using mini kit things. Also, this we don't have super strength. I'm going to put these batteries in this remote because it's probably what we got to do to go forward here. There's, yeah, there's there's a remote control in the dark dimension. Why why the hell not? Uh, and also, there's no nine or zero. Therefore, it's a flawed remote. Well, Dormammu's not very happy about that, is he? Dormammu was distracted in Mordo's power wane. Unable to maintain his shield, he was left vulnerable. Okay. Now was my chance to strike. Right, and I'm fairly sure that I've done everything I can possibly do in here, because I can't scan things. Um, I don't think I can open this door, either. No, I guess not. I'm going to have to figure that out later, then. Let's go through this vent for now. We could probably beat up on Mordo for a bit. Four or six Mordos, that'll work too. I got an axe, I don't give a shit. Doctor Strange. With an axe. Okay, looks like I did hit him and did deal damage. That looks like an explodey no thing. Oh, he went into the other room. Okay. I only hope that Clea could continue to distract Dormammu to make Mordo vulnerable to me once more. Well, there's another one of those pictures I can I can correct. All right, before I do too much as Clea, I'm going to swap back, swap back over to the good doctor here. And I'm going to do what I can uh, as far as. Uh, any anything I can I can mess around with I will uh, attempt to just mess around with and see what I can get. This looks like power cosmic, so I can't do anything with that. Scanners. I cannot do anything with that, but I'm fairly sure I'm gonna have to make it play somehow. Um, I don't see anything else I can mess around with at the moment. Anything up here? Nope, that's in the room above. This does remind me of the bit of the extra uh, Doctor Strange level that was in um, the first Lego Marvel game. Except that at that point it wasn't DLC; it was just like an extra level that was in the game. But they they just I guess they just didn't want to do that here. They didn't even have like an extra like stud level. Like there's usually like a like a special level that you unlock once you get 100, percent and then that'll let you go to a like a a miniaturized version of your hub world or whatever and allow you to like destroy a whole bunch of, of stuff it would the express uh, purpose of getting like a million studs in order to get you know in order to like beat the level i haven't seen that in a while like at all i have i don't think i even saw that in uh lego batman 3 which is like my uh probably my favorite of the non-dimensions game i think i i consider again i consider dimensions to be oh, that's power cosmic i can't do anything with that um, I consider Dimensions to be kind of like in its own thing. I mean, it's very much a, a, a uh, a, uh, it's, it's, you know, the same sort of game, but I consider it kind of in its own category because of how it's structured and everything. But it would be nice if other LEGO games had, you know, LEGO Mr. T. Because uh, they did a good job at depicting, uh, I, 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 I talked about this before, but uh, they did a good job of de depicting, um, despite the fact that I, I was disappointed that Mr. T was not in fact the voice, but um, he had a good range of superpowers that Mr. T could possibly have. But I talked about that already, so I'm not going to digress on that even further. Let's just go ahead and... He's got a dragon. Okay, let's build this, and then 
do something. Oh, it's Rocking Horse. Okay. The bust open the door. And destroy thing. Okay, that's something I can. That's not something I can destroy like I thought it was. Looks like there's a uh, grappling hook point. <laughs> These guys with little mustaches. I see we went the goofy route when uh, designing your henchmen. Alright, so. Rubber ducky! Uh oh. Rubber ducky, you are not the one today. Oh, he's just gonna make a bunch of stuff come out of the bathtub and attack me. That's not very nice of him. I can't attack him directly. Can I shoot a laser at him? I can, but it doesn't do anything. So I'm gonna have to find something I have to... I'm gonna have to find something to do in the bathroom here. In order to, uh... Damage him. Oddly enough, I'm, I'm not finding anything here. Let's destroy something there. It gives me some money that I don't need. I don't even know why I bothered to go after it. I don't have a grappling hook, so I can't do anything with that. Is putting my shield up gonna help? Magic shield. Oh, okay, I see what I gotta do. I see what I gotta do. When he throws something at me, I gotta use my magic to throw it back at him. I've done this kind of thing before. In fact, I'm fairly sure I've done it in this game. I've at least... I have done this in LEGO games before, at the very least. So it's... This actually isn't a new concept to me. I don't know, uh... Why I didn't think about that, but... Oh. Can I block this? Can I use shield to block? I cannot use shield to block. Can I use my own laser? Yes, that was the solution. The least obvious solution, I might add. The laser is almost never the answer for whatever reason here. I hope that Clea could find a more permanent distraction for Domamu, so I could end this. I don't know, a toilet's pretty permanent distraction. Oh, the toilet's not going to go anywhere. there's anything left to do in the bathroom anyway, so... Let's just turn this bathtub into a plane. Go on a roller coaster, why not? Okay. Crappy roller coaster, looks like. I mean, I'm not a roller coaster expert. I don't particularly like roller coasters myself. But I'm fairly sure they don't, uh, they don't slow down when they're taking the pictures. Like stands around here somewhere. We're gonna need Captain America to save him though, so. Sorry. Alright, let's see what else we can do. There's anything else there? No arrows. Oh, stuff to destroy. The mindless ones. Magical beings of immense strength and power with savage dispositions and minimal intelligence. Of course. Their only desire to fight and destroy anything and everything. Trapped in Dormammu's prison and ready to burst forth. Not right now, Stan. I'm busy. Okay, so... That didn't do anything. Alright, let's destroy this stuff. It's meant for us to be destroyed. Oh, gotta make more of these. Okay. Or not make the gear. The gears are already built. You just gotta place them in the right spots. So now the switch will help. All right, fair enough. Now if only I can stay on the switch, that'd be even more helpful. I guess this is going to let the aforementioned mindless ones out. Now release. Oh, that's what those. Okay, that's what those are. It would take all of his power to put them back into their prison. Power he could no longer spare for Mordo. Because they're just kind of climbing on him and by the flames of Faltine, 
he would learn what it meant to cross Doctor Strange, Sorcerer Supreme. Okay, so we're making our way upstairs. And um, that means messing around with this. The attic. What else we can mess with here? More torches. Another painting here. Not now, Mordo. Oh, there's a... This. Come on. Come on. You destroy that. Stop. Something we can build. Okay, that's another one of those, the torches we can make. They are not their own objective, but it never hurts. We also have regeneration, so the uh, their magic isn't doing too much to us. I'm going to go in here and see what's what. Be right back. Oh, I was kind of hoping that the last picture would be in here, actually. Alright, so... I need a repair person, which I don't have. So there's not much I can do here. Let me go downstairs. Let's see if I missed a painting. I mean, I know I missed a painting somewhere. So I, have, I have three out of four. I got that one. Uh, it went there. Got that one. Was there one in the bathroom? That I missed? No? What's up here? There's something up here. Oh, there it is! And this I'm assuming we can't do anything with. That looks like it's something I would need to destroy with Hawkeye or something. Alright, let's go after Mordo now. Fly up here. Alright, so where are all the. There you are. There's no snake there. That was a waste of time. We're running low on time here, but. There is going to be quite a bit more to this. So let's activate this torch here, why not? You can always get more money that we never need ever again. But uh, it's always fun to play, I suppose. Alright, bunnies. Got any magic back. I'm actually going to go ahead and um, cut the video here because I'm afraid that if I keep going on with this, it's going to put me into another cutscene that I'm going to have to skip because it's not going to let me pause it. So when we come back, uh, the conclusion of the Doctor Strange story mode and the start of free play mode. I've been Rado Goji and I'll be here next time. Join me, won't you?